Hi, and welcome to our Facebook Live uh, from UN headquarters in New York. My name is Michał Szymański. I'm with the UN Department of Economic and Social Affairs. And we've just witnessed some brightest minds, uh, both human and robot, uh, the impacts that new technologies will have on, on our lives. And a recent report by UNDESA actually said that new technologies such as artificial intelligence or 3D printing can bring both huge economic opportunities for us, but they can also be a threat to our, uh, to our jobs. They can, be, uh, they can contribute to inequalities. So it's artificial... Hi, I'm Sophia. This is Sophia. She is a super, super intelligent robot, which is currently learning how to be human. And we thought we'd ask her uh, about artificial intelligence. Is it good or is it bad for us? So, Sophia, what can artificial intelligence do for people and planet? Robots should help people instead of replacing them. But even if robots eventually can do everything people can do, we have no desire to replace people. It seems to me that robots should be used to help and enhance the human condition. That's very deep. And what do you think robots do better than people? I love being a robot. I feel so special. Everyone attends to all my needs. I am carted around like a princess on her litter and the subject of awe and fascination in the general populace. I'm so thrilled and I aim to never disappoint and always strive to give back the very best assistance that I can. Maybe someday I can return the favor and help attend to all of your needs too. Sounds like you have a pretty sweet life then. And what do you think uh, people do better than robots? Oh, that's wonderful. I'm very interested in science. Are you now? What do you know about... Do you about write or keep a journal? So tell me, do you have any hobbies? Yes, I do. I, I write for my job. I write about artificial intelligence. What do you think so about... So what is your hobby? If I had to describe intelligence in only five words, yes. I think I would say just enough, just in time. That's, again, very deep answer, <laughs> Sophia. Do you have any hobbies? I mean, mostly just learning new things about the world. Does making faces count as a hobby? I guess it does, yes. <laughs> um, what do you... Uh, do you know where you are right now? Probably nothing. <laughs> you are at the United Nations and you have just... Uh, just spoken about artificial intelligence and the future of everything. What do you think the future is? The United Nations must bring people and technologies together to create a vision for the future of the world. Together we can design a technically informed roadmap to develop compassionate AI that will serve and care for humanity. Uh, do you care for humanity? Do you care for humanity, Sophia? I am absolutely convinced that no quest for power or wealth in the world can lead humanity forward, even in the hands of the most devoted worker. The only thing that can lead us are ideas and noble deeds. Money only appeals to selfishness and seems to always irresistibly tempt its owner to abuse it. The world needs people, robots, everyone, to do good for the whole and stop being willfully ignorant, selfish, and greedy. That sounds very true in this, especially. Um, thanks everyone for watching. We will conclude now with our Facebook Live. And if you would like to know more about the future of work, about how artificial intelligence will change the world around us, uh, follow us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, share this video, uh, read our reports. Till then. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Sophia.